year. Okay. When we moved at, when I was five years old, we moved to the Wade and Wharton place next to the bridge on Bayou Marché, next to the levee. And when I turned six, we started, I started going to school and the bus in those days was an old station wagon that Miss Tootie Gerard had and who was principal of Catahoula. She's the school. first principal. First Catahoula. principal of Catahoula. Principal and bus driver. Well, yeah, it wasn't a bus really, it was an old station wagon. So she'd pick me up. That was the first one she'd pick up. We'd go down the levee and pick up a few other kids, and we'd go to school. I was always the first one at school and the last one to leave school. So I had a long school day. <laughs> and uh, you went, a lot of your, your older brothers would go to school maybe three days a week and then work two days a week. Were you, did you go to school every day? Uh, some of the, the uh, early uh, August, September school days, we really didn't go to school until late September. Towards September, we'd, uh, we'd have to do some work in the fields. And uh, it was accepted in those days. Uh, anybody, any uh, child that their parents were farmers, they could uh, have, keep the child home and do the work until after Labor Day, I believe. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, every once in a while, we would stay home to do some school, some uh, farm work. Yeah. And this was sugarcane. Uh, uh, we had cotton, sweet potatoes, sugarcane, corn. In those days, corn to feed the animals. Y'all raised animals too. Oh yes, we had a yard full of animals: horses, mules, cows, pigs. Uh, chicken. We had uh, all those animals, uh, you know, at our disposal. I mean, that was an the accepted uh, venue in those days. Everybody, uh, every farm that I knew of had animals. To, you know, you have uh, mules to to plow, and uh, they didn't have tractors in those early early days for us. Uh, what do you remember eating? Uh, my mom's cooking was uh, white beans and rice with meat. Uh, that was basically the basic staple of our household. White beans and rice and, uh, and meat. And for breakfast, a hamburger or two for breakfast. Uh, sturdy, I mean, very... Uh, Party uh, meals because you're working in the field. It takes a lot of energy and a lot of uh, uh, endurance. Do you remember uh, what y'all do for Christmas? Christmas was very uh, shabby. <laughs> Other than for food, uh, we uh, we had very little toys or anything like that. Uh, mostly, I share toys with uh, Eric. Eric Bona, uh, I'd go over there and play with his toys, or uh, he'd come over to our place, and we had an old sawmill in the back on the side of us. So we had a large, large uh, stockpile of sawdust. So Eric and I would play in that large <coughs> pile of sawdust. And